up everyone mark from the world's okayest farmer i have another product here from kemimoto that they sent me that i want to share with you guys uh you can use it on pretty much you can use it on a lot of different side by sides it's universal but uh it's it's gonna be good for a hot day like this let me show you what it is all right so hardware And brackets, heavy duty brackets, Kemimoto's logo on it, very solid, very durable, coated real nice. All the links for these products will be linked in the description below along with a discount code. Uh, I believe it'll link to Amazon but they also have a website. And uh, I'm going to show you what this is because I'm looking forward to it. They give you good directions on how everything installs. So they got their brand on there, both sides. Looks nice. Um, hardware's nice. It doesn't stick out too far. That's nice. That's some, showing some quality and craftsmanship. The back brackets are threaded. They give you all the hardware, they give you an Allen to tighten them up, they're recessed so they're flush mounted. Um, pretty good quality, pretty heavy duty. I'll show you what goes on here. It's not included, you have to buy separately, but I'll show you what it works with here in a second. Alright, so assembly takes less than five minutes. Uh, we got the back plate on now, the bottom plate takes four of those little screws, same thing. And then they have three, they have couple different ways you can mount this they give you two different sets of hardware they give you regular shanked um, screws bolts good size I can show you bottom plate back plate on tight they give you like a self tapping style bolt there's three holes so you can mount to the back with these two or I'm sorry one up here two down here or you can set it they have it I'll show you some pictures from the website they mount it right on the rail putting bolts down down through the bottom three spots right there to secure it I don't want to drill holes in any of my machine to mount that you can mount it in the bed too I just don't want to drill holes in the plastic so I'm gonna mount it with heavy-duty zip ties and I'll show you that but they give you the hardware they got washers self-locking nuts all the hardware is covered you would just need uh, wrench to tighten those up two straps that I'll show you they go in the back this holds a water cooler on so you can have a large amount of water or Gatorade or whatever you're using when you're out on your job sites if you're using these for work or even if you're using using them for pleasure you can carry enough drink for all your riding buddies whatever so you'll see on their video I think they have it drilled in the back right right down through the bottom using these three holes into the bed rail your water cooler will sit right off the side so you can just walk up and pour yourself a drink off the side I'm not drilling holes in my machine um, the other thing you could do there's this pocket right here that goes all the way down there is a middle piece in it so if you've got a piece of like three quarter inch steel straight stock and you cut a slot in the middle you could drop it right down in here and mount this it would be this width and it would you know mount right onto this piece of steel drop it down in that slot in the bed rail and you can mount it that way also um, I don't have that piece of steel I would have to go buy it from the shop so I'm zip tying mine on a couple different ways you could do that also I'm gonna use these two brackets I have light brackets from them also that I gotta make a video on um, I got the brackets from Kemimoto they're not very expensive and I bought aftermarket lights to mount on the back there for reverse to light it up um, so all this stuff you have to watch what you have and how you're gonna do it um, I think if I put this on depending on how you do it you can still dump the bed But you could also set it right on here at an angle pour your drink off secure it here secure it to the top through here and uh, You won't be able to dump your bed without removing it, but you could still if you're not you don't always dump your bed so I'm going to go through here because my zip ties are really wide if I had more narrow ones you could use the mount hole up top I'm gonna run it up through here 
like so. These are pretty heavy duty. And tighten it down on here. And then I'm going to cut these tails off. And I'm going to take one more. And these should be more than enough to hold the weight. Um, I'll put one on here, down through. I'm leaving uh, these loose for a second to run these straps through. One's up top that I already routed, and then there's one here. I'm just going through one side and out the other, like so. I'll have to check their instructions and see if that's how they actually want it or if you need to weave it in and out. So in one out the other. They're just full type ratchet straps. Got those routed through now. I'm going to finish tightening up these zip ties. So I got two wire ties up here, large ones, big ones, and one down here. It's got a little bit of play, but not much. Um, you can use any five gallon drinking cooler. Um, we're going to go put some water in this one and uh, rinse it out real quick since it's new. You'll have to provide your own, of course. And then it sits right on here, like so. And you can pour yourself a drink. You got these straps that we got to put on. You can take it, I'm gonna take them through the handle. Cinch her up. Might want to put it just under that lip to secure it. Push in, push in on the tab and pull. Nice and snug. That is snug. That one is as well. All right, and there we have, now we have five gallons of drinking water attached. The bed won't dump if it's in that position. The bed will still contact it, but we're in good shape now to at least drink while we're working. All right, like I said, Kemi Moto has a ton of products. I have mirrors from them, floor mat from them, utility box for the bed, one for under the seat. I have videos on all of them. I got smoke tail lights from them. I have a light whip antenna I still have to mount. And then I have two brackets for two rear facing lights from them. Um, they make a lot of good products. I'm, I'm happy with all of them, but definitely check them out, their website and uh, they have stuff on Amazon for sale also. I also have a cool little dome light from them, floodlight map light. That thing's pretty nice and adjustable. They're not very expensive. All right, so here it is. You can see they got their brand on both sides. Nice, uh, it's gotta be at least quarter inch thick. The, screw, the hardware's flush. It's got a nice coating on it. There's a bottom plate here that supports your jug. You could hang cups on here. They make those cup holders uh, depending on which one you get. But this is not included, just the, uh, the mount. You can mount them on the bedside. I'll show you some other pictures of how they have them mounted. This is how I wanted to do mine, up here, out of the way, and not drilling any holes. some water pour yourself some water
Check out Kemi Moto if you're interested in one of these five gallon water, drinking water uh, brackets for your machine. They work good on the job site. Everything will be in the description below. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more.